This video brought to you in part by these fantastic sponsors. Hey guys, what's up and welcome to the channel, The Shotgun Shogun, and in fashion, as it's recently been happening, they like to tease a lot of things right before the patch notes. Now, we are going to be getting the KR, uh, the KR stream, we should be getting it this in the morning, and they like to tease these things a little bit ahead of time. Now, this is Loena. I believe that's how you say it. Anyways, if you're familiar with the story, you will know who this is. I won't spoil it for anybody who hasn't got up to this point in the story. However, uh, it will it'll it'll be spoiled tomorrow for you. So there's that. But anyways, for those of you who do know how who this is, she was teased a while back and she had animations in the game. She's part of the story. And a lot of people are like, well, we'll see if she actually gets put into the game. Well, it does look like we are going to be getting this character. Now, one of the things that's kind of interesting about this is we've been getting a lot of RBG characters uh, kind of quick, right? So we got Quaric, we got Pavel, we got uh, Cerise, we got this character really, really quick and back to back to back to back without too much of a delay in terms of, you know, time in between. Now, this is going to be pretty interesting because this means that the next part of the story is coming, and I feel like we're going to be wrapping up the story here fairly soon-ish, which means that we're going to be in kind of like a, a stasis period. We're going to be getting the next part of the story. Everybody's going to be like, oh man, I can't wait till Strauss comes. Been saving for Strauss forever. And this will be interesting to see just kind of how this goes. Now, one of the other things is that we did get they did show that we are going to be getting episode two, chapter 10. This is going to be coming out tomorrow as well, or we're going to be getting more information about it, right? So that's going to be pretty sweet. We're also likely going to be getting information about Wyvern 12. We're going to be getting information, well, Hunt's 12. We're going to be probably getting more information about who the next ML4 star is, because that should be coming up soon. Now, it is, it is believed that it is going to be ML Angelica. We also should be getting exclusive equipment information here real soon, because we haven't gotten any in a while in terms of exclusive equipment or specialty changes, things like that. So take a look over here on e7 leaks which again if i'll link this down below amazing site the dudes who put this together are the real champions so new adventure chapter chapter 10 obviously is what we're going to be getting we're also going to be getting the april fool side story i don't have the picture for that because it looks like they took that down from the facebook page i saw it this morning while i was browsing through the facebooks as i you know do when i'm doing my morning business while i'm letting the dogs out i'm scrolling through looking at funny dog memes and then i'm like oh hey look epic seven posted some stuff i'm like oh hey look epic seven facebook group posted about how much they hate arbiter vildred again what a surprise oh but when i went to go back and look at the picture gone so we'll see we definitely know that it's going to be coming it's going to be april fools uh they're going to post up uh because since the new admin of the facebook page is an absolute meme lord i guarantee they're probably going to put up something like uh hey guys we're going to be giving you guys an ml five star selector uh because we love you so much and they're like oh ha, 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 april fools and it's actually going to make a lot of people salty but at the same time it will be hilarious uh so we are going to be getting stuff like that so i'm also hoping that we're going to get more information about the japanese voices when we're going to be getting that uh we're going to be getting it looks like we're going to be getting the data mine rose skin as well uh, and that could be a free skin that's going to be coming from the side story itself because we already had an epic pass and i don't think that they're going to run multiple epic passes over top of each other and i also think that it won't be just a here go buy this skin i think that they will put that in some sort of reward kind of like the aether skin from the side story so but the big thing is here is that we're going to be getting we're going to be getting loena and it'll be interesting to see what what she is i'm gonna go i'm gonna go out and on a limb and say uh, probably i limited ice, ice, ice unit, ice unit, because, you know, we, we need a couple of those actually, uh, that would be really cool if they put in another limited ice waifu, um, 
that would be probably my favorite thing that could ever happen. But there you go, guys. Uh, not a whole lot of information. I am looking forward to the patch notes in the morning and to see what it is that we are going to be getting. By the way, as an update for the video yesterday on the Guilty Gear, so I was a little bit bamboozled. Um, I was looking at it kind of early in the morning, and I didn't see anything on the site that indicated that it was just a fan page, so I do want to apologize for any confusion on that. But I do think that it is still a solid time for them to rerun the Guilty Gear collab. And I know a lot of people are like, man, but I don't want to rerun. Well, I also would like something brand new. But at the same time, I would also like to be able to use my Biken in PvP or in uh, RTA. And I also think that it's not really fair for Europe and JP to not have said characters. And I think that if they were to never rerun it again, um, that would be just a big waste of, of time and stuff like that. Not only that, but it, having her actually come in uh, indicates that uh, because a lot of people are like, well, they animated her, but they're probably not going to bring her back into the game or put her in the game. And well, guess what? We're probably getting her in the game. I would almost guarantee they don't usually tease things like this without it being a brand new unit. So I, I hold out my hope for the Guilty Gear rerun, but I do want to apologize for that. My bad, guys. Uh, I will be a little bit more diligent on things like that in the future. I did update it in a pinned post. A lot of people didn't read that, however, but you can't expect people on the Internet to be able to read or look at the comments before posting other comments. Anyways, guys, that's it for me. Let me know. Do you think it's going to be a nice waifu? I almost guarantee it probably is because that's just what they like to do. Now, I would personally like to I would personally think that it would be an ML unit, but I can't imagine that this is going to be the ML four star. Like this is too big of a character for them. Just be like mm, ML four. Yeah, have fun with that. Now we could see them kind of maybe mix things up. Maybe they're going to just go back to back ML fives in the mystics. I doubt it, but we'll see. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think down in the comments. And as always, I'll catch you later. Take it easy, homies. Peace.